Hallelujah to Jesus. We give God a glory. Let God be exalted in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. This is God's soul channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you. Please comment, like this video, share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you as you do that. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Child of God, hear me very well. It is just a matter of time. <laughs> you see that Jezebel, because when I sat down here, I hear the word Jezebel is running after somebody, you know. They have been doing this for so long. They laughed. The situation of this person, you just hear them laugh. This is very serious. It is not, maybe it might not be for everyone. You can hear those that are trying to attack you or afflict your life. You can hear them laugh. Like they just start laughing. They just start, start laughing like they have finally done it. Oh, they have finally succeeded. They didn't succeed anything. They did not succeed anything. You know, Jezebel was so confident in, in her evil acts. This is a situation of somebody right now. Jezebel was so confident in her gods. She was so confident in the gods that she called upon, that she wants all nations to honor, that she wants all nations to serve. You understand? She was so confident and she went ahead and made the greatest mistake of her life. She laid a curse upon herself in the quest to distress somebody else. This is something that someone is facing right now. But you need to understand that no matter how Jezebel was being confident with, his, with her evil or with her idol, you need to understand that her day was just noble. Her days were just known by the Bible said the days of judgment, the days of the wicked is at hand. The Lord will recompense, the Lord will reward, the Lord will judge. Hallelujah. Vengeance is mine, says the Lord. So no matter how comfortable they feel, the thing they are mocking you and laughing. You know, when I hear this word, I realize, I remember sometimes when I'm praying, maybe I'm praying a very strong warfare and I hear voices laughing at the person. So sometimes in this journey, I'm now beginning to realize that there are foundational powers who thought they have already concluded on so soul. And they look at how well we are praying, they are laughing like they have an evidence. So that laughter always be a way that God used to tell me to expose their foundation, you know, through the blood of Jesus. So whenever I am praying a warfare and I hear that voice is laughing at someone, I'm watching the person on my chat, I am hearing voices laughing at the person. And the next thing I said, well, this, for me to hear that voice of laughter from the enemy, it means that there is a legal ground in that foundation. You know, being in a warfare ministry, everything have, you have, you still need to have that knowledge and that wisdom. So that means that there should be, there is a legal ground in that foundation that give them legality to start laughing over what that person is receiving then i have to leave the person and face the foundation because the blood of jesus it is our sacrifice hallelujah so whatsoever legal ground that was laughing at the at, at that person the blood of jesus it is our legal ground that can swallow every other legal ground you understand what I'm talking about. So the day of this woman is noble. The Jezebel that is after your life. No matter how Jezebel was so confident with her evil, thinking that she will be able, with her evil, she will be able to swallow Elijah. She will be able to kill the name of the Lord. She could not. She could not. Hallelujah. There is somebody who is always making, looking for a way to find fresh attack on your life god said i should tell you her days are number it is not about who have been laughing it is about who is going to laugh last it is well with you jesus love you and i love you with the love of christ i remain your sister evangelist said by the grace of god i will see you again bye bye